Hello, dear friends. Today we're setting off on an enthralling journey through the vibrant and spicy world of chili peppers. These airy little gems are more than just a spice. They're a testament to passion, culture, and the art of cuisine, captivating hearts and palates across the globe. Let's start with a staggering fact. Each year, the world produces approximately 60 million tons of chili peppers. To put that into perspective, that's enough to give every person on Earth a good pinch of spice. And when it comes to who leads this spicy revolution, Asia stands at the forefront, contributing about 80% of the global yield. That's roughly 48 million tons. This isn't just about growing peppers, it's about fueling an industry that's valued at around $35 billion yearly. Now, how does this airy tale begin? It all starts in the soil, the very foundation of our chili adventure. Preparing the ground for chili peppers is much like an artist preparing their canvas. Farmers work with dedication, ensuring the soil is rich and fertile. They employ modern agricultural techniques like drip irrigation, which provides each plant with just the right amount of water, drop by drop, ensuring no waste and optimal growth. Imagine the chili seeds, tiny yet potent, each holding the promise of eerie avors. These seeds are sown into trays, covered with a thin layer of soil, and placed in environments that mimic the gentle embrace of nature. well lit, well ventilated, and with just enough moisture to coax them into sprouting. After about 25 to 28 days, these seeds have transformed into seedlings. Stretching upwards at about four to six inches, signaling their readiness for the next chapter of their life. Transplanting these young plants into the eels is a delicate affair. It's done with the care one might give to a newborn, ensuring each plant has a soft landing into its new home. Immediately after transplanting, a gentle spray of water helps the seedlings settle, encouraging their roots to anchor RMLI into the soil. It's like a garden of culinary dreams. Regular checks for any unwelcome pests, ensuring the soil remains moist but not waterlogged and providing the right nutrients are all part of the daily routine. It's a dance of care where every move counts towards the health of the plant. About 40 to 60 days into their growth, chili plants enter a new phase, houring. This is when the magic happens, where the plant decides to bear fruit. The emergence of chili hours is a critical moment, a transition from leaf growth to fruit production. Here, water, especially with added potassium and phosphorus, plays a crucial role in ensuring these hours turn into peppers rather than fall off. Harvesting chili peppers is an art performed with reverence in the early morning or late afternoon when the sun isn't at its peak, helping to preserve the pepper's freshness and vibrant color. Each pepper is picked by hand or cut with scissors, ensuring the plant remains unharmed for future harvests. After picking, they're stored in cool, well-ventilated areas to maintain their quality. But the journey doesn't end with harvesting. For those who cherish the avors of paprika or enjoy the zing of chili sauce, the peppers embark on further adventures. They're dried, either naturally under the sun or through specialized drying machines to preserve their bright colors and intense avors. Then, seeds are meticulously removed and the peppers are ground into powders or pastes, an act that ells the air with the rich, spicy aroma of chili. The transformation from pepper to powder or paste is not just about preserving, it's about unlocking the chili's potential, making it an integral part of our daily culinary rituals. Whether it's adding a dash of color and heat to a dish, 
or creating a sauce that can warm the soul. Chili peppers have become indispensable in kitchens around the world. So, as we delve deeper into this spicy saga, remember, chili peppers are not just about the heat. They are about the stories they tell, the cultures they represent, and the joy they bring to our meals. Let's continue this journey together, exploring the world through the lens of these airy little wonders. Chili peppers have woven themselves into the fabric of global cuisine, each culture adding its unique twist to this airy ingredient. From the smoky chipotles of Mexico to the airy bird's eye, chilies of Southeast Asia, the diversity is as vast as the cultures themselves. In India, chilies are not just spices, but are celebrated in festivals like Mirchi Ka Mela, where millions of chilies are strung together in garlands, shoka. Let's talk about the science behind the spice, capsaicin. This is the compound that gives chilies their heat, triggering our taste buds and even causing us to sweat as a natural response to keep cool. Intriguingly, capsaicin also has health benefits, from boosting metabolism to potentially reducing pain. It's a compound that turns the simple act of eating into an experience of both pleasure and health. But how do we manage this heat in our cooking? That's where culinary creativity shines. Some cultures use dairy to temper the spice, like yogurt in Indian dishes while others turn to acids like lime or vinegar to balance the heat. In Thailand, sugar is often used to create a harmonious blend of sweet and spicy. Each method tells a story of adaptation and innovation in the kitchen. Now, let's move from the culinary to the commercial side of chilies. The chili market isn't just about producing peppers. It's about innovation in processing, packaging, and distribution. We've seen the rise of chili-based products, from hot sauces to chili-infused chocolates, showing how versatile this ingredient can be. Companies are now exploring chili varieties for their unique avors and heat levels, catering to a growing demographic of spice enthusiasts. The journey of chili peppers also includes modern agricultural practices aimed at sustainability. With the global push for greener practices, chili cultivation has seen advancements like organic farming, reducing the use of harmful pesticides, and employing natural pest control methods. These practices not only bathe the environment, but also enhance the quality and taste of the peppers making them more appealing to health-conscious consumers. In the realm of home gardening, chili peppers have become a favorite. They're not just easy to grow, but also rewarding. Imagine having your own supply of fresh chilies, each pepper a testament to your care and patience. For many, it's not just about the peppers, but the joy of growing something from seed to spice. Chili peppers also have a social aspect, bringing people together through food festivals, cooking competitions, and shared meals. The Scoville scale becomes a playful measure of one's spice tolerance, leading to community gatherings where eating the hottest chili is both a challenge and a badge of honor. As we delve deeper into this narrative, it's clear that chili peppers are more than just food. They're a bridge between cultures, a health booster, an economic driver, and a source of community. They challenge our palates, enrich our meals, and spice up our lives in the most literal sense. Join me next as we explore how chili peppers and their way from farm to table, the art of chili preservation, and the stories of those who make their living through this spicy trade. Until then, Keep the zest in your life.
and may every meal bring you the warmth and joy that only chili peppers can.